Welcome to Forex Success. This is a team of expert traders who came together to provide you the best strategies to make money. Subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon to turn on notifications so you won't miss any updates. Hello guys, you're welcome today and uh, I want to use this opportunity to wish you all a happy new year. So I want to show you a very good strategy to trade step in this. The strategy is powerful and it works well if you use it well. Just follow the conditions and use it appropriately. You make money using the strategy. So quickly, let's go to this setup for the strategy. Okay, you click on the indicator tab. It's just you just need three simple strategies. That's three moving average. So the first moving average is um period three. You set it to period three, shift zero, exponential, apply to close, three pixel, and you choose your color yellow so you click on done then you click on indicator tab again the next indicator is also a moving average the period 10 shift 0 method exponential apply to close start 3 pixel so this time we use red okay we click done and then the last indicator moving average use the period 100 shift 0 method exponential apply to close to be pixel for this time and then use black then you click done okay so guys this is the indicators in our chart so let me explain this strategy now this is the one minute time frame this is the one minute time frame okay so guys this strategy is simple you can see we don't have much indicators here just the moving average it's really simple and it works the strategy works 99 percent so all you need to note here is that is to watch out for the black moving average the red moving average and the brown moving average those are what you need to check out on so there are two conditions which need to be made here two conditions to check out for you see this red moving average when it crosses above the brown moving average it indicates yes sir. and then when the black moving average crosses above above both moving average which is the red and the brown moving average it indicates it's here so when this black moving average crosses above the brown and red moving average you have a sell market so that's it when it crosses below you have a buy the black moving average crossing below the brown and red moving average gives us a buy condition okay let's check out some so you see this point the the black moving average crossed above which gave us a say and at this point it crossed below which gave us a buy okay At this point also it crossed above which gave us a say okay this point it crossed below which gives us a buy you can see the black moving average crossed below both and also the red moving average crossed below the brown which indicates a buy for a say for a sir the red moving average crosses above the brown and the black crossing above both the red and the brown moving average gives us a set condition same here red 
the black moving average crossing above both giving us a buy condition okay so this is the strategy guys so guys that's not all you need to know this is something you need to take into consideration because I don't want anybody to lose trading the strategy. You can see this is life. This is life now. The the black moving average crossing above the red moving average. You can see, and what we are getting here is a buy, which is still continuously buying. You see, guys, it's still buying. Step in this. This is step in this, and it's still buying. It's still buying because the red, the black moving average cost below the, but the red and the brown moving average. You see, guys, right? So, so let me explain. Let me explain something for you to take into consideration. You have to take this in very consciously. Don't take it for granted. It's very important. So what you need to do, guys, you can see the strategy works. I want you to know. If you see that the black moving average cost above the red moving average, which gives you a, a buy signal, it gives you it gives you a reason to buy. Sorry, it gives you a reason to say. That's the black moving average crossing above the red and the brown moving average gives us a reason to say it is advisable to analyze this market also in a higher time frame. That's the 15 minute time frame. Okay, let's check this. This is let's check the time so we can do it appropriately from the 15 minutes time frame. This is um the time here is sixteen oh five first of January. Okay, fifteen minute time frame. Okay, sixteen oh five. You see guys. From this 1605, that's from the 15 minute time frame, the market was currently consolidating. And watch, the red moving average was above the yellow. You see, the red moving average was above the yellow moving average, indicating a sell position, right? Which lasted from this point down to here and that same position gave us it gave us that say from the 15 minute time frame from the one minute time frame it gave us this cell from the one minute time frame but it is very much advisable to follow the trends of the 15 minute time frame analyze so guys, it's advisable to analyze from the 15 minute time frame and look for a good entry from the one minute time frame. An example like this point, you get a sell signal from here, you get a sell condition from here, which the time is um the time here is 630 of the 28th of um, December 6 30 28th of December it gives us a reason to say here in order to not to be a part of this consolidation that's this blue candle in order not to be a part of it that means we'll have to run loss before it later becomes profit in order not to be a part of this blue candle you get an entry you take your entry from the one minute time frame so let's go to the one minute time frame and look for a good entry this is 6 30 6 30 28 so the one minute time frame okay 
Okay, I'm just trying to get an example from this one. Okay, we are we are unable to get that six thirty from the one minute time frame of the twenty eight. So let's use um let's use the this data first from the fifteen minute time frame. So this is giving us a second condition. So this time is seven thirty of that at first. So check out one minute seven thirty at first. This about at first. Okay. Yeah, this seven thirty. This about thirty first. Okay, as you can see, guys, this seven thirty. This about thirty first. You see, guys. You see what I'm talking about? It gives us a set condition also from the one minute time frame. So this is a perfect entry. You confirm, you analyze from the 15 minute time frame and you place your entry from the one minute time frame. So the 15 minute time frame gave us a set condition and the, the one minute time frame also gave us a set condition. So are they being enter this market from here? It has consolidated the so guys the seven thirty gives us a set condition. You see to so the market sold. So what I'm saying here is that it's better to analyze from the fifteen minute time frame and also confirm from the and also get your entry on the one minute time frame so i also advise to trade on the direction of the 15 minute time frame since this 15 minute time frame is on a sell your one minute time frame you should be looking for selling opportunities so in order not to run loss so this is a buy for for one minute time frame this is a buy at what time 12 31 so let's check out 15 minute time frame for that 12 31 12 31 okay there's the 12 30 you see it's a buy one minute time frame 12 31 it's a buy so this is how the strategy works guys when the black moving average is above the red and the brown it says uh, the black moving average below the red and the brown it's a buy so thanks for watching this video and um don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up so thank you also share this video to your friends so they will also make profit using this strategy. You can check out my other videos on Crash and Boom. To know how to trade Crash and Boom. It's a very powerful strategy for Crash and Boom and V75. So thanks guys.